Welcome to Life Journey Church family. I'm your host, the Alphas McPherson. Today I'm discussing about the new God in the palm of our hand. The new God in the palm of our hand. My friend, we live in a society where the Bible says, flee idolatry, which means that we are not supposed to worship no other deity. My friend, the phone become a God in the palm of our hand. Yes, we worship our cell phone. Yes. We let the phone become our God. My friend, you go on a bus, everybody head is down to their phone. You go on the lunch table, see everybody is on their phone. Family time, people on their phone. Even my daughter, yes, on the cell phone. What am I saying, my friend? I did a, a, a snippet of the God in the palm of our hand. The cell phone become the God in the palm of our hand. My friend, are you addicted? My friend, addiction is not just sexually. Addiction can be a cell phone. We worship. The cell phone like it's a God and it become a God in the palm of our hand. I'm Talking about a cell phone. I'm talking about Apple. I'm wondering, my friend, are you addicted to the Apple? I mean, Apple can be an Apple product. It can be an iPad. It can be an iPhone. It can be, go to God, your Apple computer. Are you addicted? And there are people right now, my friend, they're addicted to their cell phone. Are you addicted to your cell phone? You go to bed with your cell phone. You wake up with your cell phone. You, you take you, you at the, you're the uh, breakfast table with your cell phone. Everything you are, you are addicted to your cell phone. So I'm saying to you, my friend, the God in the palm of our hand what make this nation a nation of addiction it's not cigarette anymore it's not drugs anymore it's not even alcohol anymore the new addiction now is our cell phone glory to god people don't read to lead no more they go to the cell phone for the addiction my friend my fellow people wake up and realize that this cell phone is a new God in the palm of our hand. Govern our life. We should not let the phone take the goodness out of life. And we should not let the cell phone become the governing force of our life. My friend, it's more to life than your cell phone. Think about it, you don't even read to lead anymore. You let the phone bleed your life. You let this product was made by man to become the God in the palm of your hand. Listen, my friend, life is more than this cell phone. You let the cell phone take the place of the invisible God because you let the cell phone become the God governing your life. My friend, the Bible says, Thou shall have no other God before me. Anytime you let a cell phone possess your life, you are letting an instrument take the place of 
the invisible God. My friend, God is spirit, and they that worship him will worship in spirit and in truth. You got addiction. You don't read anymore. You don't believe God anymore. You don't read the even the, the holy scripture anymore. You don't even read a basic book anymore. Your life is governed around this cell phone. The cell phone become the God in a palm of our hand. We got addiction, my friend. We won't spend no family time together. The only thing you want to do is, is play game, text, and watch videos. That's it. You want to play games, text, talk, and play videos. It's more to life than texting, talking, and playing a video or watching a YouTube video. My friend, I'm telling you from experience, my friend. Look in our society right now. Even elementary children are addicted to the cell phone. They don't read anymore. They bleed with this technology. My friend, wake up and realize that God is a jealous God and he want us to love him, not love the cell phone above him. Hey, glory to God. So I'm telling you, my friend, the God in the palm of our hand, the cell phone become addiction. Addiction is not drugs, alcohol, or sex. The addiction is the cell phone.